And just over the past couple of weeks, both Moody's and Fitch, the rating agencies, upgraded the bond rating for New York State. And, and a lot of folks were happy about that. And, and, and they mentioned you know, the strong budget uh, being in better shape, the, the economy gaining traction and moving in the right direction. What wasn't talked about enough, but I always say it when people ask me, what do I think about the bond rating upgrade? There was a third reason why the, the, the rating agencies upgraded New York State standing. And that third reason was a very simple one. New York has a well-funded pension plan, very different than many other states. So the reality is when we talk about our New York State pension fund that you're enjoying as retirees, the reality is because we have managed the fund in the way that we've managed it and that we do not have the shortfalls that other states are facing, that has helped the overall outlook on where New York State stands as a state. And those are the states that are in trouble today. When, when their pensions were, were, were reasonably well funded, they said, okay, we, we could cut corners now, you know, cause it's all gonna be fine. And then they came up to, to 08, 09, and what could they do? They weren't adequately funded cause they shorted the fund in the good years and they really got hit in the bad year. Well, because we've kept our fund so well funded in the good years and we've not taken shortcuts. And the reality is when governors and legislatures, going back over a long history, have tried to manipulate you know, how, how, how the funding for the, for the plan is managed and, and, and the ability of controls to stand up and say, no, you can't do it that way, that's made the big difference for our fund to be in the kind of shape that it's been in. And that's, and that's a good story for New York.